Hello everyone. Um, today I'm just going to show you guys my skincare routine. Um, a lot of you guys have been asking what do I use and um, that's what this tutorial is today. So I'm just showing you the products which is uh, Mary Kay actually. Everything is Mary Kay. So we'll go ahead and get started. Um, the first thing that I use is this uh, Mary Kay and this is a 3-in-1 cleanser and I use this cleanser two to three times a week it just depends on how much I think I need and when I think I need it for my face my skin is very sensitive so um, if I use too much um, it'll turn red so um, I only use it when needed um, but this is what I use to clean my face um, and after I clean my face I um, put on this Mary Kay Age Fighting Moisturizer and this actually makes my face feel really really good after I use the cleanser. Um, it cools it down and it makes it really really soft um, as well. Um, this Microdermabrasia set um, I use this. Um, this is actually what I put on first and um, this is the scrub and it has the tiny very very tiny tiny um, microdermabrasion beads in them um, I use this only about um, I'll say once a week if I need it um, the longest I've went without using it will probably be about three weeks um, it usually you know refines and does what it has to do you know the first time that you use it and then you won't have to do it again until two to three weeks later so this is really good um this um this is the second thing that goes on after the um the microdermabrasion beads um this is just the just like a moisturizer afterwards it has to be put on just to restore the elasticity back into your skin um, and this is really really good after the scrub um, you have to have this you can't do one without the other so um, yeah I do this about once every two weeks maybe once a week if needed but um, I, I, I don't think I've ever done it once a week um, it's just too much on my skin so but yeah this is really good it keeps the dead skin cells away you know when you get dry patches in your face this is really really good for that this set is right here and lastly I use this um, Mary Kay um, soothing eye gel and um, I use this I try to do it like every morning and every night before I go to bed when I need it but um, a lot of times I don't remember so um, all you do a little bit will go on your finger and you'll put it under your eye right here and then you'll put a little bit under your brow bone this tightens your skin underneath your um, brow bone and underneath your eyes um, and it also helps with the puffiness and the bags and all that stuff this is really good um, I hardly get bags under my eye but when I do um, you know, I put this on and it, you know, slowly takes them away, you know, within the morning. Um, and I get that from my dad's side of the family. So, um, but yeah, that's about pretty much, um, everything that I use. Just a few tips though, when you're, um, you know, want to make sure to drink plenty of water to keep your skin clear. Um, keep your bed covers clean. Um, you know, wash them your bed covers, your pillowcases once a week, um, and you know, just make sure you don't sleep in your makeup. That's another big thing. Don't sleep in your makeup. Um, it will clog your pores and um, eventually you'll get pimples and all that stuff. So yeah, um, I think that's about it. Um, you know, water is key. You know, the more water, the better. Keeps your skin clear and healthy, shiny looking. So yeah. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to contact me on Facebook um, at Face by J Makeup Artistry. Um, you can follow me on Twitter at Face by J. 
Um, you can email me at facebyj at yahoo.com and visit me on my website at facebyj.net. So, yeah. Um, thank you for watching and thank you for subscribing if you have. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.